Oh, I'm not video guys, this is Will Power, and today's video is gonna be the Gum Gum Dungeon video. And uh, when I went to edit, I found out, you know, my little my intro was corrupt, right? The audio was messed up, you couldn't hear anything, so I thought I gotta do a new audio. I hid my fruit, because I have already switched off Gum Gum. Y'all can't know what that fruit is yet. And y'all gotta wait, you gotta wait for that. So, stats are gonna be on screen right now. I can't remember what I used, but it's gonna be there somewhere. Um, it's really easy to solo it, um, not too hard, as long as you stay alert, that's really it, right? You can't be, like, checking on your phone or something, you're also gonna die. Stay alert, it's really simple. Let's get the intro. Alright guys, so like I was saying, I'm gonna show y'all a demonstration on how to do this. So let me quickly get rid of these guys. So I'm pretty sure to super get bow, you wanna hit spacebar obviously, but you wanna do press S and W at the same time. They'll give you like extra geckos and that comes in handy. Not really necessity, but it comes in handy. So gapple up. Gum gum pistol. Release it. And they'll come in. Gapple on gum pistol guys. Make sure you um you look around like at the very initial the first gum gum pistol. Make sure you look around. Oh yeah, see how they keep on blocking? So just move to the side like this. And then that'll let them let go of it. It's really annoying when this happens, bro. But catch them while they're moving towards you, and you'll get them off guard. But like I was saying, um, the initial gum gum pistol. Use that time to look around and see where, um, the gunners with the bazookas are, right? So that you don't, cause you need to pay attention to them, like, cause it really will, um, it'll mess you up bad. Like I've lost dungeon because of them, like a lot. So keep a lookout on them, especially for the high high waves. Cause if you release your gun one pistol and the bazooka hit at the same time, it's gonna cancel your move and you're gonna die, right? You might get lucky because the cooldowns are really short, but like still you don't want that to happen to you. That's it really. If you get if you slip up and you mess up, do gun up bazooka, it one taps everyone. And that's it, I'ma fast forward and show how to do bosses. Alrighty, for boss, you wanna just, when you spawn in the middle, back up a little bit, cause the bosses don't spawn directly where you spawn, they spawn a little bit behind you. You wanna start your guy like the moment he spawns. Don't try to like time it up, cause you might do it way too early and you won't like higher waves, and they will punish you for that cause your galley won't finish them. So do it the moment they spawn, kinda like bombs um, explosion, right? You do, you start charging after they spawn. Save them for gum gum. And that's it, bro. Just do this. And you can finish down this super quick. Like, it's really good. Yes, yeah, so you keep an eye out. Let the bazookas pass you before you release. And that's it. I'm gonna fast forward and let's see what fruit we get. Two times Logi right now. And, uh, my get a Tori. Oh, you see right there? Don't do what I did. Don't do that. Anyway, let's see what we get. Alright guys, so that's uh, so that took about like 20, like 17, 20 minutes ish. I just saw at the end there, I messed up. Bazooka really comes clutch, bro. 
really does. I must have at the end there, I almost lost, but Bazooka came. Oh, we got Bomb Bomb. Alright, can I start? Sick. That's the end of the video, guys. Hopefully, this, you found this useful. If you have Gong Gong, Gong Gong is really, really good for dungeons, as you saw, and PvP. It's very fast. If you found this enjoyable, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, drop some comments on what videos you want next, give me some builds and what you want me to see and what you want me to do, and follow my Twitter. All my links are going to be in the description. Catch you on the next one.